Okay, so we need a big bucket, a large bag of baby peacock feathers. Oh, I already ordered the peacock feathers. Nice! And a nail gun. Sam, you're getting a nail gun? Sam? Wake up! <laughs> what? We're doing a web show tomorrow night. I Carly. Yes, I Carly. Now, would you wake up and help us? She never helps. At least I don't take nine hours to properly prepare one slice of pizza. Pizza requires a precision balance of red pepper flakes, parmesan cheese, and garlic powder. Mm, I got it. Mm. Hello? Do I sound like a Rosalinda? Adios. Hey, that pizza looks good. Yours. Mm-hmm. So what your Tina's up to? We're trying to plan tomorrow night side Carly. I see. Am I the chizzy attitude? Because the web show's getting more popular. It's getting to be a ton of work. It really is exhausting. Disaster. Why don't you guys just hire an intern? What's an intern? Like an assistant that works for free. Wait, would it bathe me? I like being clean, I just don't like all the... <laughs> Why would anyone work for free? Interns are students. They work to get high school or college to reach. How much do we get? And I just post an app on slime.com and get a ton of responses. It's weird, this pizza tastes like shoe bottom. Isn't that a kind of bread? That's a see a bar. That's monkey from Galaxy Wars. No, <sighs> oh man, <sighs> it's Grandad. Hey, Grandad, tell him I say hey. Carly say she hates you. I'm just kidding. This couch is too crowded. Okay, he's a category for the students in high school and college seeking work in television, film, or web production. I'm going to post an ad. Yeah? Yeah, Grandad, I am a man of my word. Yes, I'll let you know. <coughs> Old scudder. Why are you mad at Grandad? Because I dropped down for law school a few years ago. I made him a stupid promise. Now you dress up like a lady on the 4th of July? No. Were you anywhere? No! What'd you promise him? And if I didn't get any one of my sculptures in a real museum within three years, I'd go back to law school. When's the three years of next week? Oh God, I can't go back to work. law school. It was the worst 72 hours of my life. Worse than the time those back of dudes took you down. Ugh! Four, three, So, my name is Stu Verman. I'm 16 years old and I would love to work here as an icon as an intern. Bye! But I've only been here for 20 seconds. 20 too many. Let's go, Stu. I didn't even get a chance. Come on. I can at least finish the story about my baseball hat. Come on, I would be perfect for this job. Yeah, we'll keep your resume on file. You have to be so obnoxious. You've got to be more patient with these people. You can't just cut them off in the middle of a okay. Irony.
Seriously, I'm obsessed with this web show. Now I sincerely love to work in an internship capacity. Now I don't know if you guys are into cotton swaps and want to go as much as I am, but I get out of here! Carly, dude, it's okay. This always happens. So um, in your email you said you've done video editing. Yeah, I'm really good with cutting room flow. Nice, that's why I used to edit. Nice, huh? Nerd bonding. Sam, that's good. I definitely have my nerdy tech side. And you made this fudge yourself? Yeah, I love making fudge for people. Well, okay, Brad. We're just going to talk it over and probably you no rush. Thanks, guys. I'll show you the, the door. Okay, he'd be a perfect intern for iCarly. I love that guy. Do we even need to meet anyone else? No. Wait, there's still one more guy waiting outside. Ugh. And on the day before I started seventh grade, my dad said to me, he goes, Court, you got to learn to how to tie your own shoes. It's important. And now I can tie my own shoes without even thinking about it. <laughs> This, that was such a sweet story. You were so good looking. <laughs> I was about to say that. Well, thank you, Court. Now you can go now. Go where? We've already decided who we're going to hire. We sure have. Congratulations, Court. What? Wait, what's happening? You got the job, Sam. Yeah. What about Brad's fudge? Remember the fudge? Hey, Court, are you a good dancer? The goodest? Show us. Excuse me, what are you doing? Oh, uh, I'm Spencer Shea. It's okay, I'm an artist. Yeah, I've heard of you. Awesome, um, I just need to set up the sculpture right here. I'm sorry, but you can't do that. Listen, I made a deal with my granddad. And if I don't get a sculpture displayed in this museum by this Friday, then I'll go back to law school and I can't do that. Look, Spencer, I'm a fan of your work. And I'd love for you to be represented in this museum. Yay, but... Uh, to get a sculpture in here, you have to fill out an application, have it examined and approved by the board of the curators, get authorization of... Uh, how long does all that take? Three, maybe four months. No, 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 no. Just let me leave here for a few days. I can't. Wait. What if I take you to dinner? Like a real date. That not sound good to you? Roy? No, Roy Hugger? <gasps> Ow! You can't bring that in here. It's cool. I'll f it'll fit right in. I worked hard on it. Akali goes live in 90 seconds. Hey, I brought you girls some lemonade. Aww. Thanks, Court. How sweet are you? You brought lemonade in a bag? Is that wrong? Well, no, it is not wrong. You leave Court alone. He's adorable. Whatever. Hey, Court, I need you to send these notes you took. Sure, bud. Oh. Get on right here on this pear pad. Court? You wrote with a marker on my pear pad? Carly said I should use it to write notes on. This thing cost 800 bucks. Dude, that's insane. I can get these for a dollar. No, it hurts. 12 seconds to the show. Or my beverage bag. And five, four, three, two, 
One. Once upon a time, there was a Kali, no matter wonder and freak named Sam. And then one day, the two girls drank from a filthy bucket. And thus was born I, Kali. <laughs> filthy bucket. I'm working. Okay, Gibby, get out of here. Come on, Gibby. There he is. Now we were wondering how many baby peacock feathers can fit into Gibby's mouth. Even I want to know. All right, Gibby, open wide. Fill me with feathers. Okay. <laughs> happened our genius intern just murdered my laptop i was still webcasting no we died look i'll clean up you can't now can we fire that artichoke maybe we should fire him yeah i guess we should well you know Everyone deserves a second chance. Court deserves unlimited chances. Ah.